If you're feeling down today, subscribe to Crep Junkie. You're gonna feel a lot better. I know I would if I was subscribing right now, but I'm in an alley. You know, I, what, I don't know what shoe I was wearing the other day. It was just like a pair of running shoes. Um, I wasn't running, but it was a pair of running shoes. And I wasn't looking when I got out of my car. And I opened the door and I stepped in like mud. Um, and so my shoe was covered in mud. And I can't think of the last time, it was probably when I was maybe a child that I had a pair of shoes that were that dirty. And I felt really embarrassed to be walking around in that pair of shoes. There was just something about being in public with this like very distinct half of a shoe dipped in mud. Uh, I felt so ashamed and it was shocking how ashamed I felt. I felt really embarrassed. That one was probably a greater embarrassing moment than the buying the eBay pair by far. Because they were so new and just half of them looked old then. They were, yeah. I had to go to dinner with someone and I went into the bathroom and I quickly tried to towel them off. Um, and the entire dinner I couldn't not think about getting home so I could fully clean this pair of shoes. I went online and I looked up how do you uh, throw shoes in a washing machine to wash them? And I considered that. Um, but I ultimately didn't do it because I got enough of the mud off um, and I didn't want the washing machine to potentially do damage. Even though it sounds like it doesn't, um, I just didn't want to risk it. But it stuck with me that entire night. It ruined my dinner. I'm sorry, that was a long story. But yeah, for me, they're, they're just a, a memorable shoe for me because it's like the first proper collectible rare shoe that I got hold of and then war to death, um, wish I'd known. One big part of the whole Air Max Day celebrations has to be these three trainers right here. Now it comes under the HTM collection and if you're not familiar with the HTM collection, it's been going since 2002. This is when my heart broke because the sole comes apart here. So I, I am yet, I'm yet to get them restored. But these were a find of mine. I got them from Foot Locker and they were in the sale and I got them for five pounds. The Love Hate Pack. Released in March by Foot Locker in the UK. Not sure about worldwide, but obviously we're in the UK. The sneakers come with the love and the hate. 